Hello, my dear students, and welcome to this week overview. During this week, we're continuing talking about electric circuits, power and energy calculations, the rate at which electrical energy is converted to another form of energy is electric power. Recall that power is the rate of doing work. The unit of electric power is the joule per second or watt. Power often is measured in thousands of watt or technically meaning kilowatts. So we have here the equation energy equal power times time. Then we have examples such as an electric oven is connected to a 240 volt line and it uses 34 amps of current. What is the power used by the oven? So what we say, so what information is given? Current is given and voltage is given. Current is 34 amps and the voltage is 240 volts. What unknown I want to find, which equals power. Power equals the voltage times the current. Now I put them together and I multiply them together easily using your calculators, of course. And then, so we are going to check if our answer is reasonable or not. So the answer is reasonable because electric oven should use much more power than a uh, 1875 watt hair dryer. Another example, power and energy calculations, a cloth dryer uses about 27 amps of current from a 240 volt line. How much power does it use? So what are we going to say? We are going to know what is given to us. For example, here, current is given and voltage is given as well. So power equals current times voltage. We multiply them together, okay? And we have the power, which is measured in watts. So here we have a camcorder has a power rating of 2.3 watts. Here, what is given is power. If the output voltage from its battery is 7.2 volts, what current does it use? So here we have the power is given, the voltage is given, and what I have missing, which is the current. So I put them all together, I substitute for I, and I'm gonna have my answer. Another example, a power tool uses about 12 amps of current and has a power rating of 1,440 watts. Also right here, we have the current is given, the, the power is given, and what is not given and I'm missing is the voltage. So I substitute for volts, okay? To, to be able to calculate it. So I make voltage the subject in order to find the answer using our calculator. So once we have voltage equals power over current, we uh, divide them over uh, each other and I'm gonna have 120 volts. Okay, so energy equals power times time. So the power rating of a typical clothes dryer is 5,400 watts or 5.4 kilowatts. If you use the clothes dryer for two hours, the energy use is 5.4 uh, kilowatts multiplied by two hours. Okay, so a kilowatt per hour, a kilowatt hour equals 3,600,000 joules. So, and then we have electrical safety and what devices make electricity safe to use. Correct wiring, fuses, circuit breakers, insulation, and grounded plugs help make electrical energy safe to use.